Hello, hello. Everybody, how are you? Welcome. Dion here with the Turquoise Iris. Working on part two of this enormous wardrobe makeover. Actually, we're doing things a little out of line here, which is when I get real excited about trying something new. We're doing it out of line, ladies and gentlemen. You mean out of line? Out of line. What do you think? Guess what I mean. I feel like the light needs to come over because I'm blocking um, this whole view, babe. Do you mind moving that? There's, I'm casting a big shadow. Hi, everybody. Happy Thursday night. I'm so glad you're here. Hi. Hey, hey. How are you? So we're doing things backwards. Not really backwards. We're just doing them out of line. Whatever we think is the line. What does out of line mean? Um, out of line. I'm putting metallic on as part two as opposed to a top coat. So normally, Matt, when we do, or when I do makeovers, not you, um, normally when I do a makeover, I'm going to actually uh, save the gold for one of the last steps, but I'm going to end up actually putting some of this on where everybody looks at this and goes, you've got to be kidding me. This looks hideous. And I'm going to say, that's okay. Hang on, hang on, hang on. And I'm going to end up putting some paint back over it. So yesterday we did um, two shades. We did Mermaid Tail. DIY and then we also did mint chip and we put them on simultaneously with the VIP brush from paint pixie hello hello everybody um, is anybody on here Matt uh, we're gonna, we're gonna see one here a few okay so um, and then I'm just this was just the base coat that I put on but right now I'm actually just kind of doing like a you know what's going on it's gonna end up to where I put the paint over it and then all of a sudden you're gonna see these little sparkles underneath because we're gonna be loading some paint up over the top of this. So, so nobody you're painting can... over the golden ticket? I am gonna paint over the golden ticket. You're really messing with steps right now. Yep, I'm messing with the steps. So I'm gonna grab my water bottle, which is the water girl. I just sprayed my face, it's good. And I am gonna get this golden ticket running I'm gonna actually kind of make it seem like the golden ticket is part of the base coat. So, I'm gonna get this going. A bunch of ladies and gentlemen getting on. Hi everybody, hope you had a great day. Tomorrow's Friday and I'm telling you what, I have um, had a super busy day. Um, we made a big announcement. I have partnered with some other ladies. Uh, Debbie Beard from Debbie's Design Diary. If you're on YouTube, you may follow her already, or, well, a lot of you already do. She's the owner and artist at DIY Paint, too. She and Kara with Kara's Color Me Vintage, we are going to host a big workshop in McKinney, Texas. And I don't know about you, but McKinney, Texas is just like a really charming, um, the downtown area is where we're going to host it, and um, it's going to be like on a stage apparently, and it's gonna be super wonderful. Um, do you have a plan? I do have a plan, pass forward, I really do. Um, I didn't print off my inspiration image because I went to go look for it and I couldn't find it. <laughs> Someone's taken a lot of photos lately. Um, but I'm actually gonna use the golden ticket as part of my backdrop. I also, the next thing I have that I'm gonna use before we go off tonight is Salty Kiss with my petty knife. So just hang tight. You guys know that I layer and that I build it up. Um, not, these raised panels right here, yesterday I couldn't use the words, but someone so kindly left me a message uh, telling me that they were raised panels. Thank you. Um, often when I'm live, I can't remember words. Um, I'm gonna hand paint my own design on here. No stencil, no transfer, no anything. I'm gonna just kind of hand paint my own design. I'm hoping that Matt comes up with that for me. Uh, Matt, have you practiced or um, do you have any idea what kind of design you're gonna want me to do? Nope. No? Did you know that I was gonna tell you to do that? Nope. Yeah, I just told him. Ah, I just told him. All right, so I hope everybody's having a great night. This is part two. We started a brand new wardrobe in this I don't know, how, how long did we, how tall did we say this was, babe? Uh, I think it was 98 inches. You are lying. So the goal is actually gonna be part of the base coat. Susan Norton, she said bikini, exclamation, 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 yes! exclamation. Question mark, question mark, yes! question mark. Yes! Tickets are available right now on my so website. That's McKinney, that's McKinney, Alabama, right? No, dork. 
McKinney, Texas. Oh, McKinney, Texas. All the tickets are available. All of you Dallas folks, uh, we're going to be there in just three short months. Uh, all of us are coming. We're going to put on a big workshop. Uh, we've got an MC, Kenise Blair, Kenise Sheik. We are going, we just, Zanesville was so much fun and we just absolutely had a great time. We just thought, let's keep this going. Like, let's, let's keep doing this. You know, I still have workshops at, at Reclaim Warehouse. I actually have one in February, but in March, oh, I love the way this already looks, but just keep in mind, we're putting paint on top of it. This is actually part of the base coat. So what's going to see is I'm going to put some of this, this clay base paint on top of the metallic and you guys are going to have no idea the layers that I actually applied these unless you watch this video, of course. Um, but yeah, you can actually go to the turquoisecyrus.com and see tickets for that. Tomorrow night, Friday Night Live on YouTube will be, um, I will be with Quita Allen of All Stabbed Out in Denison, Texas. I assume that's where we're going to be in her studio. We're going to do a painting. Are you going to be, are they going to be like four different paintings? Or are they going to be all the same painting? What do you mean, Matt? What do on, you mean? On your four little thingy whoppers, the circle things? The circle things. The raised panels are all going to be the exact same. Okay. I'm going to create a design for both, but I was hoping you would work on the design for me. Um, I've had, yeah, I've had a few people say butterflies. I like that idea. Butterflies. Yeah, maybe, maybe uh, a dinosaur or two. Dinosaur. I think you're making that up. No. I'm, I feel I'm, like you're I'm totally... I'm brainstorming right oh, now. Oh, well, I don't like it. Maybe a motorcycle or... Um, a motorcycle. Really? Yeah. Come on, give me something good, Woods. Uh, maybe some clouds or something. Does anybody have any questions while Matt's being s silly? Clouds. It kind of already looks like clouds, doesn't it? So I'm gonna let that. I'm gonna let that set up, and then I'm gonna need to grab my salty kiss. <laughs> Yesterday, everybody was causing, calling this the um, frozen, the frozen piece. Oh yeah, you could do, you could do the the, the snowman on frozen. I don't no, know baby. No, honey. This is a sophisticated piece. Is it? Yes, it is. It may not look like it yet, but it will be. <laughs> Did you just question, is it going, like what? Uh, no, Gavin, uh, Susan Davis said vintage flowers. Vintage flowers? Uh, Lance, totally. Lance House said maybe a honey badger. Okay, Lance Howe? That's You're right. right. I like the honey badger. You're right. That's really okay, good. that's my brother, you all. He's being on ring. Gavin said uh, either <laughs> birds or Japanese buildings or something of that nature. Gavin, you're on top of something. I like that idea the best. I like it, Gavin. Sunflowers, dragonflies. Okay. We're, get, we're getting oh, some no. good stuff Oh, no. Bring them to me because I've got to come up with a design of my own to hand paint. But i got to get this kind of base coat going first. Maybe winter evergreens. Well, you know, guys, you need to know. The overall color scheme is going to be turquoise, but you have to know this is going to look a lot different when we're finished. But we're just adding on our layers because... I mean, it's real kind of Christmassy right now with the... It is not Christmassy, babe. Well, the golden ticket makes it Christmassy. No, it doesn't. It makes oh. it sparkle. That's it. Mountains. There's some mountains. <laughs> mountains would be beautiful, except I've never done that. So you know what reminds me of? Remember that time when we were younger, we had our picture taken at the fair, and it was an old timey picture. Yeah. That's what it reminds me of. This like, does. At the bottom, you know, like where it's the old kind of like copper, kind of coppery old. Oh, it thing. has a sepia. The You're thinking of sepia. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. The of. sepia print. Um, it's sepia. Though. We were yeah. we were like 19 and 20, and we had our picture done at the fair in the old timey clothes. Yeah, I think you had a like shotgun, that. and hey. I had on this big fluffy dress with a bottle of whiskey in my hand or something like that. You did have a bottle of whiskey in your hand. And that was funny, wasn't it? That was funny. Well, you come on. Alice, Hi, guys. Alice joined us. From Hi, Florida. Alice. Blessings um, to you, dear. We got, we were telling everybody our... Denise, Colorado. Water lilies and dragonflies, says Water Susan, Susan lilies. Davis. Dragonflies. I There's like a lot of wildflowers on here. Well, because they know me. They know that I'd give anything to just paint water fly wildflowers. Uh, the Vargas is cherry blossoms and bamboo hand fans. 
cherry blossoms, and bamboo hand fans. Like that's 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 pretty cool. You are smart. What are you spraying? It's just water from the Water Girl spray bottle. It's just water. It's a continuous spray bottle. Um, Golden Ticket is really thin already, but I'm really just wanting like a real sheer coat. I'm gonna end up here in just a second. We're gonna grab some Salty Kiss, which is our really beautiful, like a it's like a jade green um, color that's pretty new from DIY. I actually painted my front door this color, our front door. What? Our front door. I said my front door. It, it is your front door. Let's to be... just be honest. It's yours. <laughs> what does that um, mean? <laughs> Julie Fincher Graves, what are you spraying and what is the, lay, the layer you are doing? What is your goal for this piece? Just for it to be really pretty. Ultimately. the the <laughs> it's to be it's, My goal is for it to be really pretty. Um, I kind of, I have a, an idea and I have a, a visual that I'm working off of. Um, I couldn't find it or I would have printed it to show you all. Um, but I do know that the overall color scheme is going to be turquoise. Um, and the raised panels will have different colors on them. But I'm going to create, trying to create my own design. And I may throw in the towel. I may try, 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 and then paint over them and end up doing a stamp or a transfer or something. But I really, really want to try my hand at my own design. Uh, whether it be shaky or not, or, or, or you know, just the way that it is. Um, yeah. Okay, so I'm kind of hey, letting this... Donetta Bates Harmon, I am not ignoring you. I apologize if I'm missing stuff. Oh, did you get in trouble with Donetta? I think Donetta just got on me. Ooh! What'd she say? I don't know. I'm trying Donetta, to find it. where I'm is she? Is it. she on YouTube or Facebook? No, she's on the Facebooks. She's on the Facebooks. Donetta's on here a lot, so you better pay attention, huh? I'm telling you. <laughs> okay. Oh, Donetta Harmon, I found it. She said, do the four seasons. The four seasons. That's actually a pretty good idea. I like that, Donetta. Good idea. Oh, I like this. Oh, wait. This just gave me an idea. Don't do it. Don't do it. Shh, 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 shh. Shh, hang on. All right, we've just changed our plan just a smidge. We just we rerouted everybody. What, but we, did you have we, a plan before? Yes. What was your plan? This wasn't that this because now I love the way this looks so much that now I'm actually going to do this all the way just here on all of these panels. I got it, Woods. This is a good plan. I got this. This is a good idea. Yeah, I got it. All right. Uh, Crystal Neal. So far, it seems like a turquoise stone color scheme. Maybe paint something southwestern? Question mark. A turquoise what color scheme? What'd she say? A uh, turquoise stone color scheme. Maybe paint something southwestern. Maybe. Maybe you got our spray bottle just ordered. Thank you. Enjoy. Paint Pixie's shipping those pretty quickly. Just so you know. Uh, where's the dog? The what? Where's the doggy? Oh, she's in there by the fire, you guys. I'm telling you, her leg is sore. I think she's pulled a muscle or something, and she, she is like, we have to say, come on, get up, get up. And <laughs> we got, we got the big Debbie Beard on here. Debbie Beard. Yeah, she came to see what I was up to. She came to see what you were doing. Yeah, she's been keeping an eye on me. You know? Did everybody see that video? She's been keeping an eye on you. Making sure you're doing, staying out of trouble. Yeah. Being she's, nice. Well, I'm the talent, so she's like, you know, she's kind of, she might be signing me to a long-term agreement. Not sure. Maybe. <laughs> yeah. She did create hashtag more Matt. It is her fault that your head won't get through the door. Um, however, did everybody see the new video out by De Debbie's Design Diary? Our Zanesville recap on YouTube guys it is so good and I can't it's funny so many people probably eight different people said today to me either on a personal call um, training calls that I do or um, through messenger that they literally were brought to tears and, and just so inspired by this video and even one of like my mom's friends 
was very moved by the video and said I should come. Said like referring to her. To the next one. Okay, yeah, I am so loving this. Like I know it looks like a hot, crazy mess right now, but guys, just hang on. Hey, um, Carol promise. Slater. She's just curious. Uh huh. Like a curious cat. Yep. She said, "Can DIY paint be used to paint a wall?" Absolutely. Yep. It certainly can. You just put a sealer over it. Make sure you seal it. If I were doing a wall, I would use Big Top to seal it. It's true, true, Jennifer. My head is, 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 Dion has to deflate my head when I have to walk through the door out of here. He's really not that way, but he's being ornery. You saw Debbie's video, Wendy Miller. What did you think? You bawled like a baby. Oh, Annette. Hi, honey. Annette McShane bawled like a baby. She wants to come to the next class in McKinney, Matthew. And I won't be in McKinney. Okay, nobody panic. This green, I promise you. I promise it's going to be all right. Right now, it's like, what? But it's good. Just hang on. Kind of looks like you messed up. Kind of looks like I messed up. Yeah. Oh, I like it. But I didn't. Sus Susie Chilbert said it looks cool. It looks like you're creating a gallery. Thank you, Susie. I appreciate Robin, your faith in me, sister. Robin loved it and bought a ticket to workshop in Texas. Oh, Robin! Look, look. Robin Roy? Uh, Robin Cicilino? 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 Sorry, I'm messing up your name, Robin. He's not good at names. It looks Italian. Yeah, it sounds like yeah. it. Yeah. Cicilino. Yeah, no, I, I, I have your receipt, girl. I got it. Uh, what green is that you're using? This is Salty Kiss. Love it. But again, we're still working on the underlying layers. Um, we actually, guys, we released those tickets last night right before bedtime. And we offered 24 VIP tickets. And we've already sold... Half of the VIP. Why don't you tell somebody real quick if they don't know where to find Debbie's video, where to find it at? Um, Debbie, if you're on here, will you grab the link on Facebook? If you're on YouTube, go to Debbie's Design Diary. Or you can do that on Facebook as well. Go to Debbie's Design Diary and click the most recent link. It, it was um, most of VIP is sold. Yes, Debbie. We've sold over half of the VIP tickets to the McKinney workshop. Okay, it's Robin Siciliano. Siciliano. Okay, Sicilian, Sicilian, Siciliano. Siciliano. And no. Debbie, and no. will you grab the link okay. for the video, or for the, yeah, your video and post it on the, in Facebook, please? Okay, uh, Tan Rob. Hi, Tan. Um, how do we know which to use on furniture when finished? Wax or another sealer? What's the difference? Ah, mostly, I'll tell you what the difference is and how this is what do, helps me decide it. Um, both work perfectly well. Hang on. Both work well. I prefer wax for a, when I'm doing a piece that has a more rustic finish and I don't want any shine, anything like that, um, I'm definitely going to go with a wax because it's not as shiny. I use like Big Top or our liquid crystal chandelier patina when I want something that's much glossier. So that's what determines it for me is a um, whatever finish I'm wanting. Also with wax, you can be so much more creative because you can add in more colors. So let's just say the last piece that I did, it, I used Monet's Garden with two other greens. I ended up doing black and white wax on top of it and it just gave it a totally different look. It was almost like it was iridescent um, and it just had like these casted some shadows on it. So I personally love the um, love the wax more. Um, I will use Big Top for a glossier finish just so you understand that. And I'm going to get some of this gold coming on down. I look at this right now and I think they're not gonna understand what I'm doing, but it's all right, you guys, just hang tight with me. Hopefully this isn't your first time here um, and you followed along some of my other makeovers before. Uh, Robin Harrison. Yep, hi Robin. Uh, almost looks like Alice 
in the looking glass. Alice in the looking glass. Will be beautiful once you do your hand painting. Thank you. Thank you for having some faith in me. Um, Judy Brackenfern, hope we get to dance. I'm assuming she's referring referring to the class. She is. She bought her ticket today. All right. She is. That's Judy. She is a coming with a couple of friends. VIP style, right, Judy? What? what? Okay. All right, I'm just getting that green off. All right, Matt, are you still doubting me? Uh, Carol Slater's is starting to look like a 1920s piece. Oh, I like it. I like it. It's going to go through some phases, I can promise you. What phase are we in right now? Phase? Um, it's messy. Where, are, we in, just, are we in an I'm not real sure what I'm doing? Phase? No, I know exactly what I'm doing. Stay over there, bro. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Don't say that. Snappy. I know what I'm doing. Come on. I know what I'm doing. It's just messy. I hear Abby. She got up. You hear? She's, yes. She's I outside the door. She heard you yelling at me. She. <laughs> I think she heard you teasing me and making fun of me. Okay, this one. Oh, here we go. How do you like that, Matt? I'm not real sure if I like I know, it or Are you not. panicking? No, I'm just not sure. No, that's all right. You don't have to. You don't have to know. You cannot paint a piece uh, of furniture. Tara Williams on the YouTube. Mm -hmm. When you work with the molds, how long do you leave it air dry clay in them, or can you just pop them out and finish them? Um, you need to probably let them dry for about 24 hours before you um, apply them. But then again, someone else may tell you something different because I'll be honest with you, um, I'm not a big mold user, so I haven't had a lot of experience at them. I like the stamps and the transfers more. Are you still going to use the turquoise wax on this piece? Planning on it. Okay. All plans were intended to be changed, though, so bear with me. <laughs> Carrie Lynn Coleman, she put hashtag doghouse for Matt. <laughs> <laughs> hashtag bedside for Abby. <laughs> Ooh, Abby just moved up tonight. Uh, Matt got moved down. Guys, this is just the, uh, yeah, like, have faith, please. Look, she's, oh, she's putting her nose. You want me to get her? Yeah, you can get her. I think she just wants in here with you. Maybe she has to potty. She's not here at the door. She was. She was just standing there. You could see her little nose sniffing. She went back by the fire. She went back to the fire when we didn't get up to let her in. All right, so these are all just underlines. The water's rushing down. Under layers, under layers. It's just like with any kind of painting, you guys, you got to have the under layers the way you want them. Um, the main, now, is that blue iris? This is actually bohemian blue. Oh, okay. Are you going to use the blue I iris? I have to use blue iris because I said I'm going to use blue iris on every piece, that, every piece I do till the end of the year. You gotta have lots of drop cloths here too, guys. Lots. So Debbie, Debbie Jackson joining us from Kentucky. Hi, Debbie. She's on the YouTube. Hi. Okay, so looks like a mess right now. Yesterday we started simultaneously adding the mermaid tail with mint chip um, as the base coat. This started in with some salty kiss. We did golden ticket before that. We're gonna end up putting some more paint. So. There will be golden ticket, but it's going to be just kind of randomly. And guys, it's going to be one of those that when I take the pictures, you're going to see all these little details that I'm working on, uh, making it really unique. Your spray bottles came to your shop today. Awesome. She, Debbie is referring to the Water Girl spray bottles um, that are available on Paint Pixie's website under the Turquoise Iris Collection. It's that continuous spray. It has 12 ounces. So the ones at the other big stores uh, just have six ounces. Um, thank you. Thank you so much. It's a little bit different. I always try to create um, a more of an artistic paint finish rather than just slap it on and it's done. So, oh good, thank you guys. Um, so guys, a couple of things. 
If you want to grab a ticket and come to McKinney, Texas and hang out with us, we're going to put on um, a workshop. It's full of inspiration. If you missed it, if you don't have a clue what I'm talking about, grab the video, grab the link from uh, Debbie's Design Diary that she released last night. It's going to give you just a little sneak peek of what it will be like at the next one. Um, I do, if you're local, I do actually have a February workshop at Reclaim Warehouse um, where I will be there. Paint will be available. Uh, transfers will be available to you as well, as well as paint pixie brushes. Um, and even bigger than that is my groups opening up. I forgot to mention it. Uh, well, hey, honey, you told me what, don't forget about your group. I did. I did. Thank you. I said, Matt, make sure I tell everybody about the Creative Connection opening up on January 1st. So um, that is a creative group that I um, manage. And we're opening up January 1st and 2nd. So if you have any questions about that, feel free to DM me or email me, Dion at the turquoiseiris.com. Um, I need to let this set up before I do anything else. I'm going to kind of do a few things right here because I can. So I'm going to add a little bit more gold here. Um, so and then there's... Able to see if you go too high, though. Okay. Can they see me right here? Yeah, just, just, just right here? Yep. Yeah, I'm going to do it right here. Just while, in case there's anybody with any more questions, Matt. Uh, Mandy Driscoll, she just wanted to say hello from Hi, Australia. Mandy. Hi, Mandy from Australia. She's just rubbing it in her face that she's in Australia. Where it's warm. It's so warm there right so, now. I think it's summertime right now. Yeah, right? they are like having 110 degree weather, I heard. Some of the ladies in my group were saying that it's just they don't feel like painting because it's 110. Ooh, Karen Brown has a nice idea. Hi, Karen. She said each raised panel paints different views from your France trip of Monet's Garden of Flowers. Oh, that's a good one. I have about 100, 100 pictures of just Monet's Garden. I could go through and pick out my four favorite, but could I pick my four favorite? I don't know. But no, that's a great idea. Karen, thanks for the suggestion. Uh, Crystal Neal, Steely Neal. Steely? Steely? Yeah, Steely. Mm -hmm. yeah, Steely. Uh, Dogwood Blooms. That would, could look nice with the brown branches. That would be pretty. Yep. Yeah. Uh, Mandy Driscoll said it's only 112 in Australia right now. Only 112. That's it. Only 100. Not too bad. Not too bad. A favorite combination of mine, you guys, is the Bohemian Blue with the Golden Ticket. I'm telling you, it's a good combination. I get the hot mess idea, guys. This is not the finished look. More Matt's head can't get through the door. <laughs> Mary Sherbrooke. She's from Oklahoma, Mary is. Hey, Mary. 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 I know. Mm -hmm. I, was, I was saying hello to someone else, too. She's from Oklahoma. It's cold today, but you know what? They're saying 60 for Christmas here. 60 for Christmas here, guys. We're used to ice and snow on Christmas. It's crazy. Let me see. Do a little bit higher. And then we'll have to call it a night. It's so almost past my bedtime. I know, babe. It's, you gotta get to bed. Gotta take my vitamins. Yeah, be garlic. Gotta take my vitamins, and then I gotta put the dog to bed. It's just, you know, it's a it's process. It's a rough life that you have. It's to a do. process, I'm telling you, somebody has to do it. <laughs> Uh, Manny Driscoll said they're expecting 122 degrees Christmas Day. Holy moly. Oh, 122 degrees on Christmas Day. And ask her what part of Australia she lives in. Or I guess I just did. You just asked her. Yeah, I yep. just did. Yep, yep, okay. Hey, Mandy, the only one wanted me to ask you which part of Australia you live in. Oh, I love this. I love this green with the gold. I don't think it's uh, very attractive. Queensland. Here. Queensland. 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 I am positive this does not look that great. I am positive that there are people popping on here going, I don't know why people watch her. Like, this has to be the live week daily show that nobody watches. Can you believe Debbie Beer just got on here and said, oh, 60 is so cold. Debbie Beard. Debbie Beard, Miss San Diego. Yeah, she is cold when it's 60, yes. But, God, we lucked out so much in Zanesville. We had the best weather. I mean, we wore jackets. That was so Carla good. Larson, uh, she said hi from Iowa. Hi. Okay, 
Uh, Ree? Hi, yes. Ree! Yes, I yep. love her! I guess I missed what the spray combo was. The dark water spray. Can you repeat that, please? Anything for you, darling. It's water with bohemian blue in it. That's what it is. So it's about one to two ounces of bohemian blue with about 12 ounces of water. That's all it is. Um, I like to use this a lot. It gives everything just a little bit of a tie-dye water effect. It's very subtle, but I tend to use it a lot on um, especially large pieces like this. So I get it, guys, if you're looking at this and saying, the girl, nobody should be watching her, everybody, nobody, nobody. But if you just bear with me, guys, and hang on, day after day after day, it might start to make a little bit of sense. So if you haven't watched any, if you're on YouTube, go to the playlist, um, click Parisian um, Hutch Makeover or Pip, um, Pick um, Antoinette. That was a total drastic makeover. Ooh, sweet secrets. Yeah, secrets that aren't secrets, Ree. I need some oysters, by the way. You know, honey, she makes those ceramic oysters, that, the one that I have by the bed, I mean, by the bathtub. What about them? She makes those. Who? Ree. Oh, yeah. On Ree. here. Yeah, yeah I like it. Those are nice. Yeah, they're beautiful. You can actually cook in them. Um, I would, I would just like to make a comment here. You would? It's actually Ree's comment. She... She, I just want to point out, okay, Rita. she's very observant, Okay. and she said something that I think everybody should hear. Oh, gosh. Rita, what did you say? Matt, you're such a hard worker. Mic drop. Thank you, Rita. Thank you. So on that note, we need to, like, sign off. Ba -bum -bum -bum. Um, you guys, thanks so much. We'll be back tomorrow. I will not be on YouTube or on Instagram tomorrow. Tomorrow is my Friday night weekly show called Friday Night Live. I will be um, on Facebook though, and I'll be with my friend Quita Allen in Denison, Texas. It's her birthday on Sunday. And so, no, is that right? What? Yes, her birthday Sunday. And so I'm taking her her gift and we'll do a live from there and paint on a canvas. You all have a great night and stay tuned. Nobody panic, nobody unfollow me, nobody unsubscribe. Just give me time. Give me time. It's going to be a lot of fun. You guys, um, if you have questions about the course, the workshops, um, send me a DM or a message and I'll let you know. Anything you want to say? Stay nah, warm. never mind. Stay never warm. mind. No, there's a lot of cold ladies out there. Just keep keep warm. Keep warm. And That's and then Minnie Mini Driscoll, she can stay cool.